want to write the expression 9x squared minus 36x minus 3 in the form a times the quantity x minus h squared plus k. So going from this form on the left, ax squared plus bx plus c, to the form on the right, or the form a, times the quantity x minus h squared plus k. To do this, we'll follow these four steps. Step one, if a, the coefficient of x squared, is not one, we'll factor a from the x squared in x terms. Notice here, a equals nine, which means we'll factor nine from nine x squared minus 36 x. So that would give us nine, and then we'd have times the quantity x squared minus four x. Now the next step is to form a perfect square trinomial. So let's go ahead and leave a space here. We're going to add a constant to complete the square of the next step. And then we still have minus three. And notice how here when we add a value here, really adding nine times that value, which we'll have to undo, so let's write minus a constant here. Now step two, we want to form a perfect square trinomial. To do this, we add b divided by two squared here, where b is the coefficient of the degree one term, or the coefficient of x. Notice here, b is equal to negative four, so we're going to add negative four divided by two squared, which would be negative two squared, which equals four. So we're going to add four here to make this a perfect square trinomial. But now step three, we're gonna undo the value added to form the perfect square trinomial. Notice how by adding four here, because of the distribution, we're really adding nine times four, 36. So to undo positive 36, we'll have to subtract 36 here. And then finally step four, we factor the perfect square trinomial, which is the trinomial here inside the parentheses. Now because we know this is a perfect square trinomial, it is going to factor into the quantity x plus b divided by two squared. Notice here, b divided by two is actually negative two, so we are going to have the quantity x minus two squared, but let's also show how to factor this like we normally would. We would have two binomial factors, Then here we have negative three minus 36, which would be negative 39. Factoring the trinomial, we'll have a factor of x here and here. The factors of positive four that add to negative four are negative two and negative two, so we have minus two and minus two. Writing as a perfect square, we have nine times the quantity x minus two squared minus 39. We now have the given quadratic expression in the form requested, which is the form a times the quantity x minus h squared plus k. We'll notice how a would be nine, h would be positive two, and k would be negative 39. I hope you found this helpful.